갖고 이렇게 원아 어 원아 라이브 이렇게 하나 둘 This is how they manage the parking space to make sure that you are a paying client or a paying customer at the hotel. So today we are returning our car rental because we won't be needing that anymore. And in the hotel car rental area. And Starbucks, na the salute. Okay, so this is the rental company.
Who in the thought, you know, who would come gamble in the middle of the heat? Because remember, when they started building this stuff, there wasn't air conditioning, guys. It was hot. You know, the, 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 the audience, let's go to Vegas and sit here and sweat and pull on the goddamn slot machine, okay? Come on. Who? And, and back in those days, they wore suits and jackets and looked all nice, not shorts and a t-shirt. So come on. You know, someone had to really think. Think about this. I'm going to try to find somebody that will give me money to build a casino in the middle of nowhere and figure out how to get people there and take their money from them. <laughs> what kind of salesman was that? But yet here we are. You know, a true belief of build it and they will come. And we're here, uh, you know, in the best dang place that I can think of and, and, and living in. And I've been living here since 1988. My wife was born and raised here. I have a 17-year-old son, and you know he's turned out okay. He lives in the Sin City, but he's a good kid. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so please take this moment to really cherish the fact that from wherever you started, be very proud of where you're at right now, and take the time while you're at the top to reach back and pull somebody up. It's, I'm in a place right now that, you know, I'm looking down and, you know, the president and all that great stuff, look, it's just a figure. I'm still a guy, still have my thoughts. But trying to figure out, you know, my job now is to figure out who the next leader is and who can I help bring up. When I was a broker, when I, I still am a broker, but when I was doing my job, I was trying to figure out what realtor I wanted to have, you know, who can I bring up and train and, and make their life a lot easier and figure out how to, you know, share the wealth is what I'm trying to say, I guess. But it, it truly is an honor <coughs> to be here. No, no, don't, don't have, give yourselves an applause because truly you guys deserve it. I'm, you know, I woke up in my bed this morning. You guys flew to get here, so I did not do much to get here. So, <laughs> it was pretty easy. I broke down the damn street. So, with that, um, I, have more, I can talk some more if you want, or you want me to talk more? Really? No. My, my, my wife says, no, cut them off and we'll start talking back. Um, you know, and think about Las Vegas, though. Where else can a mob lawyer, a true mob lawyer, become mayor of the city for 12 years? and then decide to give the keys to the city to his wife, who then runs the town for the next 12 years. So almost a quarter of a century, we'll have a mob-connected family as the head of Las Vegas. Think about that. Now, there probably might be some, corrup some corruption in the Philippines. I don't know. I've heard some stories. There was some lady with some shoes back then. But, I want, I'm not going to get into the whole skit, so. But thank you guys and gals very much. From the bottom of my heart, I'm honored to be here. And you guys, you know, seriously, it's a great pleasure. Thank you. Thank you so much once again. Congratulations to Miss Lenny yes. G.
the next day. Wala, wala, wala. 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 W